<laughs> Hi everybody, welcome to my channel, Mona here, and it's finally our collaboration day. It has been an exciting uh, journey with the four artists and um, teammates. It was really lovely. Um, so here I have my 18 inch uh, cradled board with a wide rim uh, an inch and three quarters of an inch and i already dressed it with my pillow um, which is jacaranda jacaranda is from sherwin williams now I'm putting my uh, first color here, which is uh, again um, <laughs> a custom color which I've been uh, doing lately. And this one is made of Amsterdam Skylight Blue and African Jade uh, color art pigment. And uh, now I'm, I'm taking my spatula and um, uh, with some emperor's gold and trying to put uh, like a, you know, kind of uh, some effects there. Mind you, when I finished with the video, I actually uh, took it off. It was too much. Um, didn't add to the beauty, it actually subtracted from the beauty of the piece. Um, so then, and uh, so now we go with the second color and that is um, also made of three pigments <laughs> and I just happened to have these pigments ready and I just, you know, um, add them together. And sometimes I made them also on the spot. So um, I had here um, Tropic Blue, I have African Jade, and I had the third pigment is... Um, Aquarius. So I kind of uh, get mixed between Aquarius and Oceanus. And uh, now I'm just putting a little bit, a little bit of uh, Emperor's Gold there. It's a bit darker than usual gold and I think it adds to this turquoise uh, or turquoise color uh, base. Again, we're going with the colors of the fall. Uh, so now here I have a mix also of vermilion, um, orange from Amsterdam, and is orange. So a mix of two, and um, I love orange. And again, like, you know, orange on this pillow is delish. <laughs> So now I have also added here a bit of Reflex Orange by Amsterdam as well. And I kind of like to to have to have like a surprises in between, like you know. And now after I had uh, the Amsterdam I put here um, orange peel pigment. Yeah, I mean, I really used a plethora of colors here. 
and uh, but I don't put them on like on top of each other. I kind of make uh, like a map of <laughs> or I choose, uh, you know, locations here and locations there for this color or that color. It's kind of uh, the way I do it. So then um, after the orange peel pigment, I went with the that dark um, pigment reddish, uh, reddish wannabe pinkish, and that is blushing pumpkin from the latest uh, set, uh, rustic, uh, rustic Earth. And then uh, <clears throat> back to an old color. No, not, uh, not actually an old color. It's poison ivy. Not that old, actually. Um, I thought I was gonna, I was dealing with uh, olive. Now this lovely, 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 lovely um, <laughs> yellow is Isadora. And uh, now to top it off with the one and only Rustic Earth. Sorry, the set is Rustic Autumn, and this color is Rustic Earth, and it's yummy color. So yeah, lately I have been doing this um, uh, kind of more colors and uh, see what happens. Now, <clears throat> you saw now that I have my um, palette knife with uh, a mosaic of uh, copper and selectivator, but also a bit of white. Um, and yeah, it gives you a different look. Now, my word that would complete the secret phrase is made of two words between a bracket is your so and now I am just going ahead with uh, basically um, you know seeing if I can uh, um, correct something or the other um, I think here I'm trying to take the, um, yeah, I'm having question about that uh, emperor gold on on the on the surface on the pillow. So, um, but I was blessed enough to have gorgeous, I mean, cells and like all the colors together played like. Uh, an orchestra, kind of, <laughs> a lovely uh, symphony. Um, and uh, I was so happy by the time I finished this piece. Now, it wasn't supposed actually to be this piece for, um, for uh, this um, collaboration, but finally I made up my mind to show this piece. And I think with the help, of course, also with um, the ladies and, of course, I trust also um, their uh, input and advice. And so I went with this one. And hopefully the next few days you're going to see another totally, totally different piece and that was my first choice. Now, so you know, uh, and now we'll go to the, we'll go spin. And luckily enough here, I have, I mean, I have enough design, like I have a design, I have also enough uh, cells and, the cells are multicolored and uh, 
some of them are timid, some of them are, you know, uh, shouting, as we say in, in, in my language, shouting color, like the, the orange, for example, or the rustic earth, that brown, dark brown with... And I love the fact that it was just shimmery. <laughs> well, too many pigments there, and uh, so, um, so here we, I go, and I don't know what I was saying. I say, I think I was saying I'm gonna take this, uh, this golden, and I'm exactly, exactly. Uh, so I started here taking. Uh, putting some paints over uh, those areas. I mean, this piece and the design of the swipe was actually so rich that adding anything beside it will just ruin uh, the look of uh, of the swipe. And, um, and, and also the fact that it has so many colors into it. You don't need actually those, um, uh, you know, golden uh, patches on the pillow. It's also a beautiful kind of turquoise wannabe pillow. I've had it for a while now. And uh, so, yeah. Now, I have covered the rim. And I left only maybe two millimeter that edge uh, to be covered by the pillow or the design, but the rest was actually left as wood. I like that. And of course, I'm, now I'm showing the details of the piece here. And you can see like all the colors are like the green, the orange, the Excuse me, because of the way I lay my colors, you get to see the the colors of the pigments or paints that I put in this particular section. I love it. And yeah, this is it basically. I love this part as well. Yes, this, this part is beautiful. Um, when I enlarged this part, I had, I could see like a, that um, light blue like here. It just like, it works like a water canal and I can see depth in it. And uh, so this is it. And then, well, I had to be, to take some courage. Here you can see some of it is enlarged, I think. Uh, yeah, you get to see some details here. The green, the, yeah, everything, basically. Now, this time, I got the courage to resin my piece. And uh, soon enough, we'll see that. Um, yeah, look at those, uh, those cells and those, the cell activator actually is taking uh, a color here and a color there and I uh, look at that, this part here, I love this part. Yeah, and here, yes, this part is gorgeous. This orange with this um, rustic earth is just amazing. Now here, here I'm showing it now with resin already applied. And if you probably noticed the rim became darker, I elected to resin the, the, the rim. Uh, oh. And uh, this is it. And this is, guys, the one of the sets, the three sets that each one of us will be able to give you.